guys, today I want to show you how to use our smart unfold modeling tools for Rhino. And this is actually a new plugin for Rhino and you can use it to create a French uh, what's a complicated French uh, for sheet metal model. So it's very handy to use and then <coughs> more productive. So today I want to show you how to uh, use our these tools. And uh, this is actually the uh, web page that if you want to use our software, and then you first download these tools here from uh, our website here. That is free to trial. You can have 30 days free to use. It's actually the same function as the licensed version. So uh, it's very handy to use. You can give a try. And just a moment, this is actually our model. And you can see here, this is actually, assuming that this is a plate, but you can just, you know, uh, can be a sheet metal model. So if you want to create a fringe in Rhino, then uh, you can use our tools here uh, to easily create it. And there are three type of fringe that we have uh, implemented. So I can show you here, that is actually the first one is called the French A, and then you, you can just type the command. But first you have to, you know, load the plugin here inside this option uh, menu here, select the plugin, and then you just click the install. Uh, and then to load the plugin to uh, Rhino here, and this is actually uh, the Rhino plugin table and then you can just here showing the command here we provided this command it's very simple to use and uh, you after you load the plugin into Rhino then you have four command called then the French A and then you select then the edge here the, you can select the top edge and the bottom edge and the edge selection decided the French direction here. So assume that we select this A and then to create then the French uh, uh, goes up. So relative to the view that you have chosen. So, and you can just see here, then you just assume that this is 90 degree here. And that's actually thickness, French height, radius, is band radius here. And uh, this is French angle here with 90 degree. And the height datum, there's the four, uh, three option here. So in and tangent to band. And there's a uh, detailed description in the user guide. What then does it mean here? And this is also band position. They have four band positions inside, outside, adjacent, and tangent. So assuming that you use uh, the uh, outside, the inside, and then you can just see it created here, and then they'll just create the French here. So if you, you uh, view from the right here, you see here, they align up with this uh, edge here. This depends on your choice here. And then this is actually the French that you have created here. So it's very simple to use. And uh, uh, certainly you can just choose in then the outside. I'll show you here how to choose an outside here. And that is French A. And then you can select this A. And then you send outside. And then you can see here, this is actually the line up, this line up with this uh, plate A here. And this is actually then the band position. But it's a different combination here that you can choose based on your own requirement. And this is actually then the French A. So, and then we have chosen another type of French like this one here, and French B. And then in for this type of French, you can just uh, select and you have to select and more than uh, two edges here. And then you click here, and then he will show you here uh, the exactly the same height here. The data going to be remembered. Uh, when, you, when you give the input last time,
<laughs> the program can record that and then you can just use it here and adjust and then you can create uh, this one here this is actually then the French that you have created certainly you have adjusted the height height datum and the band position here this is actually then the new friend you have created all different parameter you can adjust and and this is actually then the type B here and then you can you know s select then three friend here B and this is actually the age here okay then you can choose exactly the same or then you can just see adjacent here adjacent for example and then you can just select and this is actually the age that you can select it will be easy to create model for you here and this is actually then the French B that's a detailed description how to use it in the user guide it's very simple and, and then you can just try here and this is another one is actually French B and I uh, know this is actually we have just chosen here so we just don't need that here and then we type French C and and then this one is actually you can just use an uh, relief uh, sh on the side of the relief here so here you can just have a square round and a tier and then assuming that you have a square and then you can have uh, this is actually the size of the relief width and then offset the start offset is actually refers to the point that you have selected you select on this corner close to this corner and this is starting point if you click click on this corner and then there will be this end going to be taken as starting point here and then you can just create it here like this one you see here and this is actually the shape here you have created you can certainly adjust on the different sides here the parameter here to uh, adjust here so you can have for example uh, choose another C and you can just using this uh, on this side here for example here and you can choose choosing here and then there will be offset like this one here and also many uh, parameter that you can choose in here for example French C and you can have uh, you, you have choosing this one here and they have round here so it just then the shape going to be like round here right so, and yeah uh, that is actually then the this is actually then the, the shape then French C and then we can just have uh, another last command here I want to show you here is that uh, this is trim command the trim command is very handy and then you can just uh, assuming that you have you know this one here we can choose different part uh, trim part here this this one here and you have for example you have this kind of uh, plate here and then you just create another layer here and then you just move this one here uh, to this layer and close this one here and then delete it here okay so and for example you can type the command sm trim Okay, and that is actually you just type select this one here, and then you can ch you have to choose then the close count for. So in this case here, you just close this one here. Now uh, give another layer here, and then to delete this one. Uh, no, we just close the choose this contour and plus this one here and then hit enter and then they will trim for you here this is actually it's very handy tool here and this is actually then the main function for our new plugin
just try it's free to try and uh, you have 30 days here to use it here and if you have any question please let me know thank you bye